Hi, everyone. So today we would be talking about some thoughts or ideas that'll help you live your healthiest life. We all know what I'm talking about today, our immune system. Whether it be the flu season or common cold that is going around, or you are just trying to give your immune system a little extra help throughout the year. The bottom line is this. Your body has its first fighters when getting sick, which is your immune system. However, what if I told you that potentially some foods you are currently eating could be compromising your immune system? Yes, it's true. A few foods may be incredibly delicious, but they can have a negative effect on your body's ability to protect you from infections and illnesses. In this video, I talk about the worst foods for your immunity and why you should avoid them or at least cut back on them drastically. But don't worry, I'll also share healthier alternatives that may help support your immune system. Read on until the end, some of these foods may shock you. So, let's get right to it. New here, be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell for health and wellness tips. Let's get started. 5. Artificial Sweeteners while sugar substitutes are promoted as a low-calorie and healthier alternative to sugar, the fact of the matter is they can be even worse for your immune system. Artificial sweeteners Artificial sweeteners are commonly found in many diet products, sugar-free drinks and snacks, all of which have been shown to be bad for our gut health. The community of bacteria residing in your gut, also known as the gut microbiome, is essential to helping you maintain a strong immune system. A healthy microbiome can be disrupted by artificial sweeteners, which kill off good bacteria, the beneficial ones that keep your immune system high. So what can you do instead? Rather than consuming artificial sweeteners, opt for natural ones such as stevia or a little raw honey. If you would like something sweet to eat, opt for whole fruits being that it is a natural source of sweetness containing immune-boosting vitamins. 4. Processed Meat Products Bacon, hot dogs, sausages, and deli meats might seem tasty, but they have a negative effect on your immunity. Vitamins for You by Cindy Vogue Nitrates and other chemicals used in the preparation of these meats are immunosuppressants. Processed meats are also usually high in sodium and saturated fats, which can be inflammatory. Chronic inflammation can lead to a weakened immune system over time, which could make it more difficult for your body to fight off infections. Include healthier proteins, like poultry or beans, into your dishes instead of processed meats. Fresh, lean meats like grilled chicken or turkey, along with plant-based protein sources such as tofu, lentils, and beans, are some good choices. These are much better alternatives that help maintain the health of your immune system and, in turn, our entire body. 3. High Alcohol Consumption Okay, let's talk about alcohol. I mean, I am not telling you to stop drinking entirely but just rule that a large intake of alcohol surely is not good for your immune system. Alcohol inhibits the production of immune cells, most notably white blood cells, which are your body's first line of defense against infection, and an excessive amount can cause a shortage in the number your body is capable of producing in addition to their capacity to carry out immune functions. Drinking excessive alcohol, too, acts on your gut microbiome, the bacterial community in our digestive system. These are bacteria that essentially protect you and keep your immune system in line. Drinking excessive alcohol can disrupt the delicate balance of your microbial flora, promoting overgrowth of pathogenic bacteria and reducing immune defenses. Drinking in excess can also lower the ability of your body to fight off respiratory infections, which basically makes you more prone to other illnesses, such as pneumonia and other lung problems. And let us not forget, alcohol dehydrates you, and hydration is vital for an effective immune system. In case you like to gulp down a shot or two, keep it within the restrictions of moderation, so one drink a day for women and up to two drinks daily for men as per health guidelines. If you prefer a healthier option, try some lightly flavored sparkling mineral water with fresh fruit juice in it, or stick to kombucha and herbal teas instead. Not only are they refreshing, but also immune-supportive instead of weakening. 2. Sugary foods and beverages. From candy and soda to baked goods and even sugary cereals, it is everywhere. 
Eating too much sugar weakens your immune system. Phagocytes are immune cells that consume and destroy harmful bugs in your body, like bacteria and other nasties such as viruses. Sugar has been shown to paralyze phagocytic activity. They break down the harmful bacteria and viruses in your body. If you eat a lot of sugar, these cells get less able to do their jobs, and the worse your immune system will work. It is a similar outcome with your immune cells when you eat too much sugar. But that's not all. Just like processed food, sugar elevated inflammation in the body. In reality, it is the very consumption of large amounts of sugar that results in spikes in your blood sugar levels and subsequently can lead to inflammation being constantly present. This chronic inflammation slowly but surely wears down on your immune system, making you more susceptible to diseases of the long term like heart disease and diabetes over time. Regular sugar-sweetened soda and sugary drinks. Other than just pumping your body with sugar, these are nutritionally void drinks. They are just empty calories that lack the vitamins and minerals that your immune system requires. But the great news is that you can still indulge in your sweet tooth with healthier sweets. Instead of choosing candy or soda, heaps reach for fresh fruits high in sweetness, but also loaded with vitamins to boost the immune system like vitamin C, honey, or maple syrup instead. Everything that is natural and preferably in minimal quantities. Sugar is quite a strong drug, and even natural sugar is added can have a negative effect on the body, so you still need to control its reception. 1. Influence of processed foods on the immune system. Processed foods top the list. I mean, they are quick, easy, and everywhere. Everything from prepackaged snacks like chips and cookies to frozen meals, processed foods have snuck into many of our diets. Having too many processed foods can do a lot to take down your immune system. Processed food usually having plenty of trans fats, sugars, preservatives, salt, etc. These are components that make things taste and store better, but also come with their issues. Most processed food is very low in nutrients like vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants, which are critical to support a healthy immune system. This poor nutrition can weaken the immune system because your body is not getting what it needs to help fight infections if you are consuming a diet full of processed foods. When you miss out on these nutrients, it weakens your immune functions, which can expose you to colds, the flu, and other diseases. This can lead to eating processed foods as a wealth of home remedies for colds, which in turn raises chronic inflammation. Even though inflammation is a normal, protective response of your body to an injury or infection, long-term inflammation suppresses immune function. These culprits include things like refined sugars and harmful fats, which we all know ill-affected in large amounts can cause chronic inflammation over time. A little more life-friendly option is to get rid of processed foods from your pantry and replace them with whole, nutrient-dense options. Eat fresh fruit and vegetables, nuts, and prepared meals of lean meats, such as fish or chicken without skin alongside good fats. They are tasty as well as packed with the necessary vitamins and minerals to keep your immune system in great working condition. Now that we've covered all the essential foods that are harming your immune system, let's take the opportunity and take control of our health. Eating a balanced diet rich in whole foods, along with plenty of hydration, will support your immune health. That's it. If you liked this information and found it helpful, be sure to hit the like button and share it with someone who might benefit from it. In the comments below, let us know which foods on this list surprised you, and please share this video with your friends so it doesn't remain a secret. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and see you in the next video.